hello guys welcome back to good show tips in this video i'm going to talk about how to fix g-sync is not working on your windows 10 and how to fix this up so let's get started the first thing what you have to do is when you're having these kind of issues you just have to go to your nvidia control panel you can search here for nvidia control panel or you can right click and you can navigate to the nvidia control panel so here i have already opened this up so this is the nvidia control panel so first thing what you have to do is i just have to click over here on the manage 3d settings i have to click on this this is the first thing what i have to do now from here as you can see that we have two options global setting as well as program setting so under the global setting you just have to scroll down here and as you can see that uh, from here it is very important that as you can see that the vertical sync v sync is uh, use the 3d application setting so now you just have to click on this and you have to change this to turn on you have to change this to turn on now as you can see that this has been changed into turn on this is very important so you just have to turn this on and you have to go for uh, apply and this is what you have to do and moving on to the next solution is all about you can also navigate to program settings over here which is very important under the program setting what you have to do is as you can see that on the program setting we have an option to select the vsync for a particular application which you can do it do it up so for a particular application as you can see we have an option called add here you can do this up so it depends i'm not suggesting this but this is the thing because this really comes important when it comes to when you're trying to turn on vsync for the games which you really love to play and you can do this up over here so this is the first step first step as you can see i have mentioned over here you have to turn on vsync and once it is done the next solution is all about you have to the next solution if you ask me the question is when you're having these kind of issue what you have to do is just have to download and install latest version of graphic drivers which is nvidia graphic drivers you have to do this up and this is really really important and you have to do this up okay then moving on to the third solution which i would like to make you notice is what you have to do is just have to go to the nvidia control panel itself and there is an option called setup g-sync right you have to click on this now from here as you can see that the third solution and one of the fix which is going to give for the G-Sync is not working on Windows is you have to turn off the V-Sync, you have to turn this off, okay you have to turn this off then wait for a couple of minutes like you know 5 to 10 seconds and once it is done you just have to turn this on. Once it is turned, while you are turning this on, you have to make sure that you are not enabling this for windowed and full screen mode. You have to turn this for only for enable for full screen mode. And once it is done, you just have to go for apply and you have to see whether the issue is solved or not. And most probably by doing the three step, it will be working out. And if it's not working, then we have one more solution, which we have to do some configurations on the game, which you're going to play, which I'll be showing you right now. So let's move to that. So guys here in the game right now as you can see that i'm on the fortnite so what you have to do is the first thing you have to do is under display you have to uh, do a lot of things like you know the solutions you have to check over here as well as, as you can see that the fps is being completely made 16 fps because i suggest you guys you can completely turn this off so uh, this is what i'm saying or you can keep this into very lowest one or you can go, go to do this up and moving on to the display apart from display when if you go to the graphics drivers over here as you can see we have uh, many options like this so what is actually it is all about and even if you keep on going down if you see the wind sync is completely turned off because that's what i suggest you most of the times so you have to turn this off so and also if you go for the refresh rate as you can see that over here the refresh rate have been and this resolution has been completely made so this is depends on it so you can change it up so uh, you have to turn off uh, vsync and you have to limit the fps limit and you have to do this up and these are the basic steps what you have to try inside the settings on the game which you're trying to play and most probably by doing this the issue will be completely fixed and i hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications see you soon in the next video peace out